Hey, what's going on? This is Justin Beasley, and I'm actually, uh, I'm driving, and this might not be the, the safest thing to do, but, um, you know, I, I really felt the need to come 100%, uh, you know, about who, really who I am, and, you know, just some of the things in my past that have gotten me to where I am now, and, you know, a lot of times that people can get caught up in a success, they can look at, you know, where your life is right now, and, you know, and they'll, 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 they'll start kind of judging you by where you are right now. And they have no idea of the story, you know, where you where you was. I mean, even uh, I'm going to try not to get even emotional when I speak about some of these things. But even, you know, when I was a child, I had a horrible stuttering problem. I mean, <laughs> when you say stuttering, I mean, that's what I did. It was said that Justin would just never speak correctly. I mean, I almost felt my like I felt almost felt like the kindergarten test. It was so crazy. I was just sad that I would, I don't know. I, I don't, it, it was just crazy just even as a child that, you know, it was said that I would just kind of never really make it. And I remember, you know, even really kind of to the point where, you know, I was a teenager and my mom was back and forth, uh, but, you know, went to Iraq twice and I had to, we were back and forth, me and my younger sister between both parents and, you know, being from, you know, the age of 15 to 17 and uh, just going through so much emotional turmoil, uh, you know, going to five different high schools. Uh, I mean, going to four different high schools five times, uh, being in an, an abusive household, um, you know, when, when we were staying with my dad and it wasn't because of him, but it was because of the situation and the people that were there. And even, you know, actually starting my own business at 18, um, putting a hundred percent into what I was doing and just struggling. I mean, I, I have always just wanted to be able to do my own thing, and and but but there are so many times where I struggled. I mean, getting ahead of myself, moving into my own apartment, can't even pay my bills at the age of nineteen uh, while in college, so broke. I mean, I was so embarrassed to even call home. I remember living off $2 a week to eat. I mean, oh man, uh, I used to just be so happy when my friends would call and say, Justin, I cook because, I mean, I was barely making it. Barely making it. Um, man, becoming a party promoter, wanting just to make more money and have more out of life. My life started, I, I mean, I met some crazy, I mean, I met some great people, well, crazy people too. And I began traveling all over, but my life just started, you know, sp spiraling downward. I mean, I was just getting caught up in the wrong things, you know, whatever little fame it was. You know, the money was okay, but it just wasn't all that great. Traveling, stressed out, grades going down in school, almost not being able to go back to college the next quarter. Bills tons of bills, tons of debt, developed an alcohol problem, just being wasted because you're so stressed out about life, wanting to give up, oh um, man, even several, like two to three months ago, taking all of my money that when I first started entertainment, getting a, getting a, a car, a Mustang, and a habit repossessed from me two two to three months ago and I had nothing to do with it. Nothing to do. I had no idea that my car note wasn't being paid. You know, uh, my prize possession was gone. That's all I had. You know, and so even when I first started the business I'm doing now, I didn't even have the money slaving around at a restaurant. I mean, that I hate it. I just could not Get, I, I work. I mean, I worked at like Applebee's for two years while in college. People didn't know this stuff. I was so embarrassed to even talk about it. Cause I hated it, hated it. And people look at just what's going on now. They they say, oh, well, you're doing this. You're having this success. You're making this money. You know, you're driving this little Mercedes, whatever it is. You're driving a F-150. All these things, and just have no idea of where I used to be. Where I used to be. And I don't know where you are right now. I don't know. But what I can tell you is that if you want change, you got to go out there. You got to get it. And you may be a little uncomfortable right now, but your true self is outside of your comfort zone. 
and I want to help you. I feel like it is my my purpose in life to help people break through. And maybe that's where you are right now in your life. You're ready to break through. You're ready to break through. You are. And it's your time. It's your time. And that's why I want you to stop what you're doing right now. Click the link at the bottom of this video. Make a decision. And take action. That I promise you that's the only way you'll be able to get the change you deserve. This is Justin Beasley. And I'll talk to you later.